Today, I have a challenge I must complete in Need for Speed. Hey, welcome back, my friends. This is something that I need to do. I realized the other day, based on people's comments from another video, that I have yet to get the platinum in this game. That basically means I've got to get all the achievements, trophies, whatever you want to call. We jump into the PlayStation over here. You can literally see I've got most of them. I've got 95% of them, but we're still not 100% complete. We've got a few to do. I thought it'd be cool to build cars specifically for what we need to do on these objectives and then do them and then we've got the platinum now normally i'm not one to really chase a platinum on a game i think the last time i attempted to get a platinum in a racing game or in any game at all actually was probably back on the playstation 3. i just found it sucked some fun away from games for me so i just kind of lost interest but consider we're so close to it it just makes sense and driving around at night really makes me wish that the next update is going to give us some nighttime activity because I love night and my nighttime is my favorite, but there's nothing to bloody do. But anyway, night ended. She's going to moan at me. Oh, wait, I can't hear you because you are muted. Get in the bin. Oh, I just realized as well. I wanted to buy a car. We do have quite a few cars that we could use as off-road cars per se, but I think it would be cool to try something new because I don't have all the cars and I'm doing my best to collect as many as possible. The R32. That's right. I think this car would probably be a very good off-roader. The R34, obviously, we already have. But the R32, we haven't actually bought it yet. And this actually has the better engine sound of the two cars. Let's jump in with this. Oh, the old boy. It sounds so good. It sounds so much more like the car is supposed to sound like. I don't know why they don't just copy this sound to the R34 because they sound the bloody same. Objective number one is to win a race with maximum off-road traction. So I think we just put rally, right? I think that's the, the, the idea here. Off-road. Because if we do rally, it doesn't actually get to the maximum traction. Do we do off-road on the differential as well? Is that an off-road differential? A thing? Then we should be about there. And then we'll slap on all the ultimate plus pass. Now, again, off-roading is something that I've not really touched upon on this game. I feel like the off-roading is better in this game. But quite frankly, it's not really my main interest in Need for Speed. I'm about that street racing, police chasing life. But I haven't done a police chase in ages. It feels, it feels like a wasted opportunity. Dual turbos. Let's go with the twins. If this just seems broken. I've got a maxed out car and it's only 283. That's ridiculous. Look how lifted it looks though. So let's make this thing look a little bit prettier as well. Make it look like an off-roady boy. Ooh, R34 front swap. <laughs> no, I'm not doing that. We already have an R34. There's no point in doing that damn swap. It looks so good though. It looks so good. I and mean, at least we've got quite a few splitters, right? Splitters are nice. It's really basically no front bumpers for this car. That's interesting. But to be fair... I've not really seen many front bumpers for the R32 in real life. It's a very difficult car to, to make any better. Oh, you see what I did there? Oh, we're doing this on the rear though. Yes, indeed. Giving it the rear to make it look more aggressive, more pointy. Oh, yes. So what you're telling me, the most popular <laughs> rap for this car is not even the rap for this car. I am, I am disgusted in us. How dare we? That's, that's, a bit, that's a bit nicer, you know? We go for the... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. So, we need to now find an off-road event to do. I honestly can't even remember where most of the off-road events are. But I do know there's one on the beach. Hang on. Oh, okay. You know what? I was complaining in my last video that they don't use all the area. Well, it's probably because I haven't done this event. Maybe they're off-road areas that... Off-road events, you know. I know I could have put the forged engine in, but it ain't needed. We're just doing off-road. And this thing's bouncing around like crazy. It feels... Oh, my God. The, the, the body roll is ridiculous. It's holding its gears really, really long. I should also use a shutter NOS because that will get me down the road quicker. Right. Off-road event. That is the first objective. Weirdly, this trophy, which I will bring up in a second, it has a very strange name that I would like to ask Ghost as to why they thought this was acceptable in any way. It's kind of, it's kind of a disgrace, if you ask me. I am the lowest level of the bunch. Well, at least I'm not the recommended level. So hopefully we ain't doing too bad. We've got some proper off-road boys here. But this Skyline off-road's better than most of y'all, I bet. We got the all-wheel drive. We got the Hikus. I don't think a Hikus actually is simulated in Need for Speed. We got the jumps all over the place. 
We, I was considering taking the mini, but the mini is not a mini. It is a Mahusin. Why on earth they chose to go with that mini, I will, I will never, ever know. Why not the standard mini? Why not a classic mini? Even if it is the new mini, go for the new JCW. Go for the new GP something. Why on earth they picked that in speed cross? I have no idea. I feel like the jumps is where I get messed up the most. I hate jumps. Stop forcing me to do jumps. Hello, Vladimir. That's the... <laughs> the Subi in the front there. Vladimir Putin. Putin, I will chase you down and destroy you. I need to win. That's kind of part of the objective. If I don't win, I don't get the trophy. So, uh, yeah, I've got to, I've got to pull on this guy. He's in a proper off-road car. Like, literally, there's off-road and then there's off-road. And he's in an off-road. But see this cool section here? I love it. It, just, it feels super, super cool to drive through. I always feel like uh, I was going to say I should avoid that jump, but then I realized how big that cliff drop is. Probably not boost on the section with the jumps because I will probably die. Oh, Vladimir, you're making many, many tiny mistakes, which will add up to huge ones. Come on. Final lap, please. Please get it done. I don't want to do this again. We're lapping people, but this man is still ahead. How on earth is that happening? Come on. He's slowing down because he's stuck behind someone. Oh, come on, Vladimir. Oh, we'll drive. Woo! Let's get it. Take the jump. Oh, mate. You're going to stay behind now, aren't you? You're going to stay behind. No, don't even try it. Don't even try it because I will probably lose. What on earth? What on earth is going on? How am I, how am I destroying Venom like that? Venom, come on. You're in, like, the best car in this race. Right. Best car in this race. Across the line. Dirty, dirty. Off-road is so much better. Here we go. Here's my gripe. Why on earth... Okay, I asked you to open that specific trophy. Can I ask why on earth this is called the Hackney Dream? I have been to Hackney, and I can tell you none of them will ever off-road in their life, to say the very least. Oh, you fam, I'm from Hackney, innit, it, yeah? Come on, blood! And that's a white guy. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. So that's one of the trophies down. The next objective is a little bit more on-road, which I'm very happy about. Now, quite frankly, I could have done one of the objectives. I could have done two objectives in this in one, but I'm going to do it in the next build. I say next build. I'm probably not going to build a car. I'm just going to use the RSR. Oh, for God's sake, <laughs> I always get excited. I'm like, huh? What? <laughs> it's just that stupid car. Right. If we go into the warehouse, one of the objectives is to have everything on your car and win a race. So that means, unfortunately, putting all of this rubbish on, which hopefully... I can remove. Oh, we got rainbow night. That's actually quite cool. We're putting rainbow nitrous on. This is the one I hate. Tire smoke. I don't. I don't. I don't need do it. I don't like it. So what we're gonna do is go for something. Let's go for candy pink. Okay. Let's play. Let's play a little bit here. Uh, no, I didn't press that. I assume we've got a purple now. I saw a couple of flashing purples. Candy pink and purple wave. Now that's a cool underglow air suspension. Look how low to the ground that thing. Holy crap! And the horn. For he's a jolly good fellow. Win a race with all vehicle effects equipped. And the second one, go from last to first place during the final lap of a race and win. Now, quite frankly, there are many events that I could do. But I think the best idea is to go on an event that is a very low level. Otherwise, I'm going to have some trouble. So we could do the oval. But I, I don't want to be I don't want to be that easy on myself. Come on, I want something different. Something we haven't done in a while, maybe. This event here, Bolt. How about we bring it down to the 180 recommended level and get it done. Final challenge. And then I've done all the collectibles, all the trophies. I haven't got all the cars yet, so there's technically it's not the final challenge. But here we go. Let's get it. <laughs> Do I really need to get ahead? We've got three laps. I'm already passing them like absolute hellfire. So I guess get another look. I think what I'm going to do, I think the, the most sense is to stay last. I hate the tire smoke. So it's so stupid. I don't want that. No. We're going to go from last place to first place on the final lap only. I'm going to stay in the back of the pack. They're, they're going to be like, oh, what's the stupid old Porsche doing? This old Porsche. Nah, mate. Do you know what? I watched Bad Boys last night. The first one again. Love that movie. And mate, Porsches, mate. I love I'm, I'm, I'm becoming an old man. I tell you. Porsche. Wow. Who would have thought? Cool brand. It's kind of sad how slow they're going. 
<laughs> just, I feel like a bully, just preying on them. My car starts to accelerate more, and I'm like, no, 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 we must not. I feel like I'm riding a motorbike. Okay, that's what it feels like. Is that a Porsche up there as well? It is. <laughs> what? Larkin is driving a beautiful... Oh, it's the black Porsche. I like that Porsche. How on earth is that, like, right at the back of the damn pack? Yeah, I definitely recommend doing this on an easier event. It just makes it too easy. And finally, we can put our foot down. And we're going to pass them on the first damn corner. If I weren't such an awful driver... I'm going to pass them all. Come on, 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 goodbye. There's a Porsche in front as well. Okay. You are forgiven. I'm still obsessed with the guy's name on the left. Ebo. <laughs> Ebo, what are you doing? Ebo, come on. Get the race finished. How are you, second? You're in a Porsche. And that's it. That's all you got to do. Though, I, I do hope I didn't mess it up because I did pass them all right at the beginning. I'm not exactly sure. Let's find out. Let's find out. Is it going to give me the trophy? Hello? Trophy? Anyone? My car is moving. It's not giving me the trophy. It's not giving me either trophy. Hello? Ah! Blame the vein. Come back in! Yay! Which means in a secondado, we shall have the platinum trophy. Come on, go away. I don't want you, I don't care about your bronze. Get lost. Be gone. Plat There's the need for speed. That's me. Mr. Pantsman the G, we have got ourselves. Now, okay, I need to go back to the garage and get rid of this damn smoke. How do I remove it? There we go. Remove. There you go. The rest can stay on, to be honest, because I, I don't mind the rest of it. I just think tire smokes. I don't know why. I don't know why. It just, it's not for me. So, of course, we've not completed everything in the game, but we've completed the trophies. We've completed the activities. We've completed the collectibles. Obviously, we have to collect all the cars. That's my next objective. I'm probably going to have multiples of certain cars as well. So, I want to get through every single car in this game. I'm going to finish this game fully because I'm, I'm really, really into it. All right, thanks so much for watching this video. Hopefully you did enjoy. Be sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you know, and I'll see you in the next Need for Speed Heat video. Until next time, peace.